excited yes. about it. Yes. Amen. Y'all can be seated. Yes. Go ahead and be seated. I, I'm making Brother Ricardo sure work for this. Y'all need to pray heavy about us taking him on that for y'all. He's love. But we're going to let him do his presentation to say, but, but Brother, go ahead and give that song that's on your heart. Okay, that's fine. That, let him give it. He's going to sing one, Brother Ricardo. Yes. Yes. Oh, go ahead, brother. <coughs>
real day. Amen. Go by the way of the grave, but he comes Amen. in the clouds. Amen. Thank God that day's real. Amen. 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 Fictitious, and everybody's excited or be excited about that. Amen. Amen. We got Brother Ricardo with us today. Yes. And Amen. we're so blessed to have you. Yes. Now, I'm going to tell y'all, there ain't no accidents. Brother Ricardo's here. And while we was at Brother Jeff Harmon's, Brother Ricardo, we met a brother that's going to come by and see us. He, uh, he did, just got enough rolls supported. Uh, they bought about five rolls off of him. And five rolls of paper is about going over to the Philippines to make 2,250 King James Bibles. Amen. 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 So that, and that, Amen. Amen. What's that? For free. For free. Yeah. Uh, that brother is going to go to the Philippines. And, and look, don't get excited, but he's taking 2,250 free Amen. King yeah. James Bibles. Amen. They're not shipping. Amen. They've already got that paid for in one meeting. Amen. And I want to let you know that, that your pastor jumped in on us. That means the church jumped in on us. Amen. 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 Cash ball a half a roll. Amen. 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 I'm excited about supporting. I said, This is from London Baptist Church. Amen. We jumped in on it. And they're all, and listen, he's going to come be with us here soon. Amen. And then by next year, Brother Carter, they're going to be in the Philippines producing King James Bibles that will be given out for free yes. to national pastors. Amen. So Amen. 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 Don't get excited. I said, Amen. Amen. National pastors. Amen. Amen. Thank God for the Bibles. Amen. 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 So we're honored to have you. I'm going to go ahead. You want to do your presentation? I'm going to shut everything off. That's this. That's God. Amen. 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 Uh, okay. Go over and kill that light over there. Amen. So Amen. honored to have you. Yes. Uh, before I play this video, uh, thank you so much for welcoming me here. Thank you, Pastor Michael Harvis. Thank you for that uh, a wonderful day. Uh, you know, this church is a very happy church. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. That's so, I'm so grateful. It's that accident that I'm here right now. No. Amen. It's the will of God. Yes, amen. The will of God. Amen. And I believe on that. God will do something to us this, this evening. Amen. 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 I am Brother Roberto Mercado, pastor of Good Shepherd Baptist Church in Conception Tarlac, Philippines, and I am married to Jean, and we have three beautiful daughters named Isaiah, 13 years old, Kelsey, 11 years old, and Kelsey, 6 years old. I accepted Jesus Christ as my personal Savior on July 16, 2002. I surrendered my life in a full-time ministry in 2004. I graduated Bachelor of Theology in 2007 and continued the work of the Lord in Conception Tarlac, Philippines. By the grace of God, He works and continues to save souls in our place and the nearby areas. God allows me to preach the gospel in jail, ministry, private sectors, and hold evangelism for youth, ladies, and men in the villages. God uses the life of our youth to reach the children and share salvation through feeding program and children outreach. I keep encouraging my people to get involved in the ministry and be part of the soul winning team and not to cease in reaching souls for Christ. Amen. God added to his church as you believers follow Christ in water baptism. In 2010, God has done marvelous work in the ministry. Yeah. My senior pastor Hello. felt the burden God had put in my heart and as the Lord works, He uses the life of my senior pastor to purchase a piece of land for our church and build a church building through the help of my senior pastor's American friends. This has been a great blessing to all the believers in our church and has made a big impact in our community providing that God provides the need of His children. In 2019, God worked amazingly in my life as He allowed me to go to the United States to raise some support. Same year, I went back home and it's great is sufficient for this cause. I was able to expand the yeah, work of the Lord pastor. and was able to start another mission yeah. work in oh, the nearby yeah. village. Yeah. God is not done yet. As the burden he put in my heart, 
and the ministry he had entrusted me. The need continues to grow and I'm praying for 20 churches or individual to be my partners in the ministry who will be willing to support me $50 a month or monthly. This whole shop is enough to continue and do more in the field of the gospel. I am also praying to purchase a church vehicle. This is essential need to the believers to be able to transport them from their home going back to the church and back. Amen. As in 1 Corinthians chapter 15 verse 58, Therefore, my beloved brethren, be steadfast and move forward always, yes. abounding in the work of yeah. God. Amen. So much Amen. As you know that your labor is not in vain. Amen. Amen. No, right. You might not be able to come visit our country, but your prayers and support will extend and reach more songs for Christ, and this will be a treasure you will reap in heaven. Once again, my brethren and sisters in Christ, thank you for this opportunity to share my burden in the mystery. Thank you, and God bless all of you. Amen. 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 Oh, that's real good. Praise the Lord. We're going to get the Amen. 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 You got anything you'd like to say, Brother Carter? Yeah. You go ahead. Amen. Take your time, brother. I'm going to. Just right. take your time. Amen. Wow. I'm amazed in this ministry. How amazed how God worked in this church. You are a happy people. <laughs> That's right. Amen. Amen, Amen brother. Amen. And I do believe that if you are, if you are a child of God, you need to be happy. Amen. Amen. Why? Because someday we will bow in Amen. 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 Praise God. Amen. Amen. I'm saved. Praise God. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Through the blood of Jesus Christ. Yes. My sin is washed all away. Amen. Yes. I was forgiven. Go ahead. Amen. Amen. By Amen. the grace of God. That's right. If you could see the video, no. All of us, we face the pandemic, yeah. COVID-19, past 2020. Amen? Amen? But in spite of COVID, Amen. we did not stop <coughs> serving the Lord. Amen. 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 In 2020, we started a new mission work in another village. Amen. Amen. If you can see that video, the another building, we started that on 2020. Amen. 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 2019, I went here. Then 2020, I start another mission work in another village. Amen. Amen. That's great. Amen. God is good. Yes, Amen. God is faithful. Yes. God is providing everything. Amen. 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 Amen, brother. Okay. That's good. Brother. So this evening, I know it's not accident. I'm excited. To be Amen. Here. Amen. Pastor, I'm excited to be yes, here. Yes, sir. We have that. I'm Amen. excited to see all my fellow Christians here yes. in your country, especially in this church. Amen. I love you. Amen. I love you, Pastor. Amen. You have a good spirit. Amen. 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 Like the pastor, like Pastor Hardy said, you need to pray for me. Amen. If you have a prayer card, please yes. pray for me. Amen. Amen. Pray for my family. Yes. Pray for the needs of the ministry in the Philippines. Amen. 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 You no. Know, as I said in, in my video, I'm praying 50 individuals, family, and churches who are able and willingly to support Amen. me in the ministry. Amen. 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 And I will believe this church. Amen. We'll work it. Amen. 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 I know this church love the missionary. Yes. Yeah. Amen. 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 I know this church love all those souls in the Philippines. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Yes. Amen. That someday he will come to you. If you will go in to pray for us and support us someday, he will shake your hand. 
Amen. Brother, sister, thank you for your support. Thank you for your prayer. Because of that, I'm here in heaven. Amen. 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 Oh! Amen. 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 Amen, brother. Yes. That's why we need to continue. Yes. Especially, I, I would like to testify this, uh, Pastor. I'm teaching also in a jail. Amen. You know what? When you come into a prison, most of the people there, they say, I don't have hope in this place. Amen. But when I came that prison, I asked the chief of police to teach the gospel for them. Amen. And he said, okay, pastor, you may come and teach all the prisoners. Amen. You know what? One of the person that I talked, he said to me, pastor, why you are here? Why, what, what are you sharing? What is your... What is in your hand? You know what? I bring a Bible. I'm sorry. I bring the that Bible in my hand. Yeah. Amen. What's in Amen. your hand? You know Amen. what? Pastor, we don't we don't have hope here. That's right. Amen. Amen. We don't have hope here because we are in prison. Come on. Right. Amen. Come on. But you know what? You are wrong, brother. I'm here to give you hope. Amen. 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 I'm here to give and share the Lord Jesus Christ in your life. Amen. Amen. For 10 minutes, I preach the gospel. Yes. Amen. Go ahead, brother. And all in that prison, they got saved. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. Then I went back home the other Sunday, the other week. I came back into the prison and this again. And one of the people who talked to me, that, uh, that tell to me that uh, he has no hope. Then he said to me, Pastor, thank you so much. Amen. <laughs> Amen, bro. Amen. I thought I don't have hope in my place. But there's a hope in Jesus. Amen. Amen. I receive him. And I know that when I die, I'm going to heaven. Amen. 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 And he told me, Pastor, Amen. when I came out in this prison, I want to serve. Amen. 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 That's good, brother. I bro. want to serve him. Amen. Amen. And I will bring my family. Amen. Amen. To the church. That's good, brother. That's good. You know what? You can buy me in. The people, they, they think that we have no hope. That's right. But through the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. Amen. Amen. The sin was forgiven. That's right. <laughs> That's right, brother. You see. Yeah. Amen. And now, when I came back, I will come again to the prison and continue to preach the gospel. Amen. 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 That's why I'm here asking for your prayer. And support. I'm also praying for vehicle. If you could see the motorcycle that I use is 125 cc only after. And my wife, every time that I go to Bible study, and visitation and to the church, only one, only my wife can ride in that motorcycle. I cannot bring my family. Amen. Right. Because we are not in, in that motorcycle. Right. Right. Amen. That's why I'm praying for a vehicle that I can use in the music. Pastor, I love you. Church, I love you. Amen. Amen. Okay, Thank brother. you so much. Please pray for me. Amen. Please, please pray for the needs. Amen. 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 Pastor, can I read a uh, Bible verse before? Yes. I go away, brother. Can you please open your Bible with me in the book of Matthew, the Gospel of Matthew, in chapter 6? The Gospel of Matthew, chapter 6. 
Amen. Now, and the Bible says this in this chapter, in verse 19. The Bible says, Are you there? Amen. Okay, but the Bible says, This is the teaching of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Lay not up for yourselves treasure upon earth, where moat and rust that corrupt, and where thieves break through and steal. But lay up for yourselves treasure in heaven, where neither moat nor rust doth corrupt, and where the thieves do not break through nor steal. Amen. What the meaning of this? Amen. Go ahead, brother. Oh. Go ahead. Preach on, preach. Go ahead, brother. I'm not going to preach. <laughs> Come on. What's the meaning of this? You know what? Everything in this world is temporary. That's, That's right. right. Amen. Everything. That's right. Your beautiful house. Yep. That's your right. Your car. Right. Your Amen. Your money. Yes. Even your life is temporary. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. 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 All things in this earth will lose. That's right. Yes. Amen. 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 Many Christians, many believers, they are afraid to lose their jobs. <coughs> That's right. Yeah. But it is sad to hear and to see to them that many Christians, they are not afraid to lose their reward in heaven. Come on. Amen. Amen. Come on. Woo. That's good. That's, That's really good right there, brother. Sound like pretty good preaching to me. Yeah. 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 If you want treasure, you That's need right. to have treasure in heaven. No. Amen. 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 That's Amen. right. Amen. Amen. Why? Because the treasure in the earth can stay to you. Amen. Can corrupt to you. That's yeah. right. But your treasure in heaven is eternal. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. That's right. But how can you have a treasure in heaven? Wrong, Amen. How Amen. can you have a treasure in heaven? Oh. Everyone saw that sin is a treasure from heaven. That's right. Amen. 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 That's, right. That's right. That's right. That's the most important. You know what? Why the Lord just came into this earth? Because of people. Amen. Amen. And we have to continue sending salt to the blood of our Jesus Christ. Who else? Amen. Amen. That's right. The Lord Jesus Christ can save so. Amen. That's right. That's only instrument. Yes, right. Amen. Don't get what I mean to say. We need to pray for. Yeah. Amen. 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 How can you have a treasure reward in heaven by supporting the mission? Amen. 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 That's right. Amen. Amen, brother. Yeah. Amen. yeah. Because I do believe everyone's soul that sin is precious. Amen. Amen. It's precious. Yes. You are precious in the sight of God. Yeah. <laughs> Why you are here, Rector? Right? Because you are precious. I like it, God. brother. Amen. 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 Yeah. You are yeah. precious in yeah. the sight of God. I like it. Amen. 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 To be excited and have pleasure in heaven. Amen. For more and for all. That's right. That's right. Amen. 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 That's the Bible says. Now in verse 21 he said, For where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. Amen. Where is your heart? Amen. Where is your heart? Where is your treasure? Amen. Your treasure is in this earth? Come on. Come on, brother. It's the same for us. Amen. Let's put our treasure. That's right. Amen. Amen, brother. Because it's eternal. Amen. 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 In what we have, Amen. Amen. Be wise in the blessing that you gave it, that gave to us. Amen. Amen. Amen brother. Use Amen. the blessing in this ministry. Amen. Amen. Use the blessing in the mission. Amen. Amen. So that you may come a lot of reward in heaven. 
Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. I love it, brother. Amen. 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 Saul, you come up here and sing that song God put on y'all's song. Amen. Amen. Come on, love your brother, Carter. That was good, preacher. Amen. Amen. He ain't on mission. We need to grab him for missions conference. Amen. 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 That's all. Amen. That's all. Amen. Amen.
And he said, be real careful what you tell God. Because right. God turned around and showed him how to do so. Right. Amen. Amen. And then he said, but God, you can't, I can't afford to, to ship them to the Philippines. And God said, we, I'm not asking you to ship them. I'm shipping you. Amen. And you're going to go there and you're going to teach them how to make Bibles. You're going to have to provide their copies. And y'all want to hear the best part about this? That there's four machines headed to the Philippines, brother. Amen. And preacher, when they get that, here's the only rule with them machines. The only rule with them is they can only produce King James Bible. Amen. And outside of that, there is no other rules. There's no other time frames or no other else. They said, that's as long as you're doing King James Bibles, they said, you can have these machines, amen. amen. And they've already paid for just in that one little meeting. Amen. That brother, amen. I don't know if he knew what was going on, but Brother Jeff asked him, said, how much is in rolls? And he, he told me, he said, they're $400. And he said, brother, how many rolls do they produce? He said, 450 and, and what he didn't know was Brother Woody was sitting over next to Brother Tony. Brother Tony said, hey, I'm buying one of them rolls for Ali. Yeah. And then Brother Woody said, well, I'm taking two of them before yeah. we leave. And then all together, there's about five or six rolls right there to the little meeting that's already been, I mean, my goodness, man, get happy on that. Yeah. And the minimum is 2,250 Bibles by this time next year will be produced and given away free yeah. in the Philippines. Yeah. Yeah. And amen. And I just want to say thank God for the day we live in. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. All right, open your Bibles up, First Timothy chapter 4. I'm going to be preaching on the latter times. It's going to be very identifiable to the day that we live in, and that's the point of me preaching it tonight. Yes. I want you to identify where we're at in this race. I want to preach on some things, teach on some things, and then I want to get a conclusive thought and tell you this. Man, I love the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 And then I want you to understand what the purpose of these days are. I heard a brother say one time, we may be children of prophecy, but we don't have to be victims of prophecy. So I say amen. amen. And the day that we're lived in, I get it, man. I hear it all the time, Brother Harvest, last days and hard Amen. days and tough days, but this is the day the Lord has Amen. Amen. And I will rejoice and be glad. And I, I don't care how dark it gets That's out right. there. Amen. I thank God that the Lord is still on the throne and He's still in control. Right Amen. Amen. And I thank God in these days we can shine real bright in this darkness. Amen. I thank God there's still men wanting to plant churches and Amen. create Amen. things and do Amen. things. And man, I'm talking about, and this ain't the time to quit. Hey, listen, I'm going to be honest with you. Now, I feel like serving God more right now than I ever have. Amen. I heard that brother preach on shooting arrows, and I thought about that king as Elisha looked at him and said, Hey, yeah. they only shot three. I mean, all Elisha was wanting to do was unload the quiver. Amen. And in these days, these latter days, I, I'm talking about we're real close to the coming of the Lord. Amen. You better wake up and realize the day that we're in. That's and we've got brother. some very identifiable things that are going on that shows us we are in those days. Amen. Amen. First Timothy chapter 4, when you land on verse 1, would you stand with me? Yes, sir. For the honoring word of God. Yes. Well, I've liked everything about today. Amen. Amen. There ain't nothing I, I don't like about it. This is the Lord's day. Amen. 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 And, I, and I'm just telling you right now, I feel like just running around this building. Amen. Amen. Brother, we're going to start raising money for that vehicle. You Amen. 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 I'm the pastor of this church. We're going to start raising money. Amen. 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 I don't know how much, but I'll tell you this. God's got a good way of raising things up. Amen. 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 And, and I'm going to tell you, I'm excited about men. I, I hear too many of them trying to quit these days when a man wants to do something. Amen. Right. I got Amen. to hear 20 men, $15. Amen. Amen. Thousand bucks. Yeah. Let's just run toward hell and try to win as many souls and Amen. turn it. Somebody help me out there. I get excited about it, brother. We're going to help raise money for that Amen. vehicle. Yes. And a preacher shouldn't have to ride on a scooter. We get, him, we get him a good donkey in, 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 a, in a good wagon for him to ride on a scooter. Amen. And if you look at me, if you're already getting messed up because I'm talking about raising money, hey, your heart ain't right. Your treasure's Amen. laid up in the wrong truck. Hey, look out here. I 
talking about God's men need more than just a scooter to ride on. Amen. 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 Every one of you rode in a car. Amen. 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 I'll get my message here in a minute, honey. I know what I'm preaching. Amen. Everybody in here rode in a car. And I say, if a man of God wants to take his wife and children to church, right. and you Amen. ain't burdened about it, That's I wish you'd get your heart right. Amen. 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 Preach on, brother. That's right. Amen. amen. I'll amen myself on that because that's Come good on. preaching. Amen. First Timothy chapter four and verse one, the Bible says, Now the Spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times some shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits, doctrines of devils, speaking lies and hypocrisy, having their conscience seared with a hot iron. Forbidden to marry and commanding to abstain from meats which God hath created to be received with thanksgiving of them which believe and know. Amen. The truth. That's Amen. good, brother. Amen. Heavenly Father, Lord, please bless you preaching tonight. God, yes. Lord, there's already been good preaching. Amen. Yes. Lord, I have brother there. God's got a, got your hand on him, Lord. And yes. I ask you to bless his work in the Philippines. God, I ask you to bless the work of London Baptist Church in Laurel County. God, I ask you, Lord, for every man that wants to do a work, God, that's a Bible believing. God, I'm talking about God fearing preacher. God, help their work to go on in these days. And Lord, I ask you to bless the church tonight. God, help our people, Lord. Help me tonight, God, to get closer to you. Yes. And God, help our hearts ready to receive yes, this word, God. Lord, in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 And amen. And amen. Now, the Bible says here in verse 1 of chapter 4, now the Spirit speaketh expressly. Now, I love that part because it reminds me that my Bible is not written by man. Right. My Bible yeah. is written yeah. by the hand of God. Amen. And God may have used different authors uh, as right. to put down the Word, but it was the Holy Ghost that breathed through Amen. them and to put down what He wanted. Nothing in your Bible is an accident. Everything Amen. in your Bible is ordained of God and approved Amen. of God. Amen. And I thank God tonight I got the right Bible because I got a King James. Amen. Amen. I thank God tonight it's say English. I said King James. Amen. Amen. I thank God that I got a Bible that God God Almighty make sure God into the hands of, of the common man. And I say everywhere there's a man, woman, or child, they need a King James Bible. Yeah. And the Bible says the Spirit is speaketh expressly that in these latter times, and, and let me help you tonight, we're in the latter times. Yeah. We're in the ending days. Yeah. I don't know if he's coming right now or if he's coming 50 years from now. But you listen to this preacher, and I promise you this, whether he comes now or in 50 days or 50 years, he's, he's coming. coming real God. soon. Amen. I'm talking about in these latter times yes. that you and I are not to be asleep. In these latter times that you and I are not to fall out at the wheel. In these latter times is not the time to quit on the work of God. In these latter days are the days that you and I are to grab the thing by the reins and we're to run toward God and we're to serve Him more now than we've ever served Him. Amen. Amen. This ought to be a day of excitement. Somebody help me. Amen. Amen. This ought to be a day of rejoicing. This ought to be a day of energizing because in these latter days and don't get down and depressed honey. In these Amen. latter days it means we're getting closer to seeing the King. Amen. That's right. Amen. And you understand the day that we're at these latter days bring some things that we be, need to be very aware of, to be very uh, uh, knowledgeable of. And it says right there in verse 1 that the first thing is some shall depart from the faith. That's Amen. Right. Amen. That's right. I'm talking that word depart means an act of going away. That's right. And we don't have, listen to me, everybody running toward the cross we got more leaving away from faith than we have going to the faith. And may I tell you the reason that I believe that is happening, it is not because the blood's lost its power. Yeah. It is not because Jesus is not still the greatest yeah. thing that's ever happened in our life. Oh, but the man. reason so many are departing from the faith is because we got so little standing for the faith. Yeah. we got so 
many that are standing in faith. And there's so little that are standing and trusting God. You understand the Bible says in Hebrews 11, 6, but without faith it's impossible to please yes. God. And we must believe that He is, and He is a rewarder of them that are diligently seeking. And in these latter days, there's going to be many departing from the faith. I say, hey, the children of faith yes. are to stand for God. We ought to be more busy about God's Word than we've ever been. We ought to be more about the faith than we've ever been. We ought to be more about the work of God and the things of God than we've ever been in these last days. We ought to be at church more. Amen. Yes, that's right. Amen. I'm not talking about this and y'all ain't been in camp Amen. meeting, but I have been. Amen. Amen. Brother, I just got back from camp meeting. We've been in almost 12 services in the last week, and I find the older I get, I don't want less of church. I want more. Amen. Amen. And in these days, we need to be in church more. So I want to say amen. amen. We ought to be desiring more preaching. Yep. Yep. That's right. We ought to be, I have a there, bless God. Amen. I ought to be desiring more preaching. My daughter Chloe was taking a nap on the couch. And she looked up. I said, Chloe, time to get up. And Chloe said, what time is it? And Clara, what time is it? And that's what Clara said to my own daughter, amen. And my daughter Chloe said, hey, what time is it, Clara? What time is it, baby? Amen. 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 She said, to go to church, amen. amen. Why? Because in these latter days, I understand there are going to be many that are falling away. But we don't have to be the amazing. We don't have to go with the amazing. Hey, I can be planted on a solid rock and be real firm where I stand. Amen. 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 Thank God. I like it. Claire, say it again. What time is it? Amen. Amen. How the mouths of babes are suckling. Amen. Come pray for praise. Amen. And in these days, dear friend, that you and I are to stand for something even if everybody else is leaving it. Thank you, Bible over to Jude. Amen. 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 I feel like preaching tonight. Amen. I feel like sending Bibles to the Philippines. Amen. I feel like raising money for a car. Somebody say amen. amen. I, I feel like doing as much as God would have us to do in these days. I'd rather leave here and broke and worldly amen. good and be rich in godly favor. That's right, amen. amen. I feel God on this. Come Somebody on. say amen. Oh, I'm so tired of this. Well, don't you know, Brother Hardis can't build a church in 2022 in the latter time. Yeah, the Spirit speaketh expressly. You know why He speaks expressly? To let us know that in these days we can stand if nobody else wants to. In the book of Jude, if you find chapter 2 right now after church, well, Jude chapter 1 right now. In verse 3, the Bible says, Beloved. Yeah. I like when that word starts that many times. Amen. It's like to sweeten them up a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. Beloved. Makes you warm and hot to the cuddly right there. Amen. He says, when I give all diligence to write unto you the common salvation, it was needful for me to write unto you and exhort you that you should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints. He says, so I wrote unto you about salvation, Amen. but I want to exhort you just for a second right. that you ought to earnestly contend for the faith. See, why everybody else is running from the faith. You know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about old-time religion. Amen. I'm talking about Bible preaching. I'm talking about Him singing. I'm talking about salvation by the blood of Jesus.
circus for. Don't give up what we died for. Don't give up what we suffered for. I can hear our Lord and Savior say, don't give up what I was crucified for. The faith that were to contend, a contender is a fighter. Amen. If you have a heavyweight champion, yeah. every heavyweight champion in the world, you know who he doesn't like? He doesn't like the contender. Yeah. Because the contender comes in the ring hunger. Yeah. Amen. The contender comes in desperate. Come on. You get a contender in the ring, brother, they ain't out there trying to slap wrist. Right. He ain't trying to make it to the card. He ain't trying to get through the decision. No, he's like what Paul said. He ain't punching in the air. Amen. He's swinging to make it count. He's going in for the win. Amen. And we're to earnestly contend for the faith. Amen. Oh, Brother Hargis, they're all leaving. Let them leave. Amen. Let them run. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to stand firm where I'm at. And I'm going to stay here till I go the way of the grave or through the sky of the air. Amen. We're to be contending in these yeah. lands. I'm so sick of it. Oh, everybody's quit. Let them quit. That's Amen. right, brother. They weren't with us anyway. 1 John 2.19 backs Brother Frank up. Amen. Take your Bibles on 1 John 2.19. Yes. If you go real far flipping now, you don't know where you're at. You can take a contest. <laughs> <laughs> and it's all right to get lost. Just don't stay lost. Amen. 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 Somebody help me right there. Amen. 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 I feel like preaching a little bit on this. In these latter times. I'm talking about they may be departing, but you and I, we ought not be getting farther from the cross. But I'm going to tell you the days we live in, Amen. I'll tell you what, they want less holiness. Amen. Amen. They want less standards. That's right. Amen. They want less preaching. Come on. But, they want less, but that's not what God wants. God, if God, you say, God, what kind of preaching do you want? He said, well, you already know I put it in 2 Timothy 4 too. And preach you the word. Amen. And yes, it is season. And out of season. Reprove, rebuke, and then exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. Amen. Amen. You say, Lord, how much you want us to go to church? Amen. He said, well, you don't have to ask. I put it in Hebrews 10, 25. Amen. Forsake not the assembly of yourselves together as the manner of some is, but exhort one another so much the more. As you see the day approach. Amen. Oh God, how would you have me to pray without Amen. ceasing? That's right. Amen. Amen. They want less. Amen. But do you find, I don't find less in the New Testament. What I find in the New Testament is God want more. Amen. He's given much. As much is required. Uh, I'm talking uh, about in these days, we ought to be on fire for God. Amen. Amen. Lord, have you send you send Bible makers to building. Amen. 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 Mr. Lord. How crazy is that? Amen. I wonder if Mr. Gutenberg, by the way, he is saved and in heaven. Amen. Gutenberg didn't make his press for a romance novel. Amen. He didn't make his press for some hardly horror magazine. God is amen. He didn't make that press. They ever had the filth to run across it. That's what the world did. They made. Gutenberg made his press. And that the word of God would be published and produced. All over the world, amen. 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 That little girl's locking it. Amen. 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 I mean, published and produced. I can get up here and hear Mr. Gutenberg now say, oh, man, we used to have to take every page. Did you know it took over two hours to transition lettering for each page to use a manual press? They had to squeeze ink every day amen. just to make a manual press. Amen. And Gutenberg up there going, y'all can just load them in a boat. Amen. Yep. Amen. Roll them over to the Philippines. Amen. Put them on the kickstand. Watch how hard the day is. <laughs> hit, pull, just hit start. Amen. And then they sound like this. <laughs> he said, man, why? You don't make a Bible as long as it took me to change the letters on one page. Amen. Yeah. And don't be looking at me now, Brother Artis, it's in the latter times. And the Bible says very expressly that they would depart from the faith. But, it does, but it does say some, not all. Not right. Amen. Right. I still believe there's always a God left remnant Amen. that's here to be the light to the world. Amen. Amen. 1 John 
Tom 19 identifies this crowd. Maybe you're in this crowd. Amen. Amen. Maybe you're getting close to this crowd. Come on. Amen. 1 John 2.19. I know a lot in this crowd. Amen. Come on, preach it. Well, as long as I've been pastoring, which bless my heart this week because I, you know, so it's, no, it's only half the throttle. It's only half the throttle. I go up and see one by heroes. Amen. Come on, brother. And I said, Brother, how's it going down there? He said, We on our level church split. Yeah. He said, It's going pretty good if that's what you're asking about, Brother Harvey. Amen. He said, I that going pretty good, Brother Harvey. Let the church split. Amen. How's y'all? Amen. Come on. I said, Well, we had a couple people get offended and they left. Amen. We want the church split. Amen. Amen. Are y'all all right? Y'all Amen. 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 I feel about this tall. No. That no. mom my, my big problem. My big problem. Mom, we got some big no. problems. Get down there, brother. We don't let the church split. Right. Amen. Amen. Man of God, too. Yeah, and, I, and I'm thinking, God, help where we're at. It is the latter days, and now they're departing from the faith. But the Bible does say some. some. But we're not to be down Amen. and out when they leave. It ain't a time That's for right. you and I to quit. That's it's right. a time for you and I to get somebody else that wants it get in church. Amen. Hey, man, right there. Amen. Amen. First John 2, 19, the Bible says they went out from us, but they were not of us. If they had been up with us, and they would no doubt have continued with us, but they went out that it might be made manifest that they were not all of us. Amen. I hear everybody today get so sad because they're all departing. Yeah. Come on. They're all, I mean, that's all, that's all you hear. Well, we're, we, know we can't keep them like we used to keep them. If, you, if you're trying to keep something like that, you don't want that. That's, that's like saying I can't catch hepatitis like it's a bad thing. Amen. Amen. Now, I'm in Laurel County. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Say amen right amen. here. Like saying I can't get that because that's a positive thing. Amen. When you ain't got something like that, you shouldn't have that. Amen. It's a positive thing. I don't want it because God never meant for me to have it. But can I remind y'all tonight how what God's done in this church and what God's still doing in this church and what God will do to this church. It might be the latter time, but I'm telling you, as they leave, we'll be staying. Amen. 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 How many of y'all been saved in this church right here? Amen. 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 God is so good. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Amen. I, they said they can't get a church down there. Ain't enough Bible believing Christians. I said, well, this word word will have back up. I said, what if you get them saved? Amen. What if they get born again? Amen. They may not be there now, but in these latter times, where everybody else is fleeing the faith, what if we stand for the faith? Amen. Amen. And earnestly contend. And don't get me wrong. Listen, I had a brother talking about wimps behind the pulpit, and he may be mad. Amen. Come on. Amen. He said, Tom, something bad happens. Must not be God's will. Come on. I said, shut up. What are you talking about me like that for? <laughs> Amen. 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 Come on. Pastor in 2022, you better keep a bottle of roll aids. Amen. About a pack of Advil. Amen. Come on, help me, amen. amen. Hey, I'm talking about these are, these, are not, these are 2022. But can I tell you that our Bible still tells me he's still seeking to save them amen. that are lost. Amen. And if 20 leaves, God always brings 20 back. Amen. When four leaves, he always brings eight back. Somebody help me, amen. amen. God ain't never forsook this church in all amen. the time I've been the pastor. We've never had a bill he didn't meet. May not have been on our time. Amen. Amen. Come on. Amen. Preach on. Preach on. We don't, we don't have anybody that we have to, when we walk through the community, we don't lower our head. Amen. 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 That's right. Come on. Y'all lower your head this time. Amen. 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 Now they're quitting, but in this day, we'll be standing even the more. Amen. The more it departs, the more we spill. Can I say this with all with all the fervency that God had given me to say this? I'm sick and tired of you and I. Come on. Getting down about who 
right here. Amen. Is this on, Mama? Can they hear me good? Amen. Sometimes I forget to turn it on. Let me say that again. I'm sick of you and I Amen. getting upset about who ain't here Amen. when God's been way too good to us. Amen. Amen. All oh, Brother Horace, but they're departing. But what about us that ain't? Right. What about us that are staying here? What about us Amen. that are staying and continuing? Hey, I say stand and fight on. Number Amen. two, they say they're giving over to heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devils. Amen. That's that's today. Yeah, absolutely. That's today. Bro, you're going to deal with it. I'm going to deal with it. We're, we're, in a, we're in a whole community here in Laurel County that is yeah, given over seducing spirits Amen. and doctrines of devils. Yes. Amen. Seducing. I want you to think about the word seducing. The word seducing means enticing from the path of virtue or chastity. So when they're being seduced, it means the spirits are pulling them away from what's virtuous in God's eyes, what's pure in God's eyes, what's holy in God's eyes. And you listen to this preacher tonight. You listen to me. Amen. In this latter days, they're not going to want the creek. Amen. They're not going to want grace fellowship. Amen. Then these days, them seducing spirits and them doctrines of devils, they want you. Amen. Why? Because you're the Bible believer. That's right. They want to entice you away from the things that God would have so you can get away from the will of God. You can get away from the power of God. I thank God that the power of God is just as real today as it's ever been. And if you're not tapped in, it's your fault tonight. Amen. But the Bible says in these latter days they'll be given over to seducing That's spirits right. and doctrines of devils that will be enticed by these things. They'll be drawn away. Why? Because in these days they want to get us away from the things of God. They'll have a form of godliness. Preach it. But they'll deny the power thereof. Amen. Amen. They'll have a look of Christianity. Amen. Some of y'all may just have a look of Christianity be just full of devils. Amen. Help a preacher out, amen. Help a preacher out. Amen. Let us look like you're godly and be full of the devil, bless God. Amen. Hey, amen. Yep. And God deals with churches like this. Go to Revelation chapter 2. Amen. <laughs> what was somebody knew that song? I love the old Bible. I'd have you sing it here in a minute. Just because I love the old Bible. Amen. amen. Revelation chapter 2, y'all know this. This is the letter under the churches. Amen. The actor here, he's writing to them, and, and he and look what he says, verse 18. He says, And of the angel of the church of the actor, write these things, saith the Son of God, who hath his eyes like unto a flame of fire, and his feet are like fine brass. I know thy works and charity and service and faith and patience, and thy works and the last to be more than the first. Amen. It sounds good. He says, I know these things that you're doing. Amen. I know what looks like you're accomplishing. Are y'all all right? Come on, brother. This is today's age. And I know, don't come up to try to fix me on doctrinal stands or right there and, and the dispensation. I understand we're, we're the Laodicea church, but can I tell you, I see pictures of each church of the day we Amen. live in. Amen. It's still for come today. On. Yep. Amen. Amen. Y'all got quiet there. Y'all got quiet. Amen. I should have just left that deep stuff long. No, brother. Amen. Amen. Thank God I got a Bible. Amen. Amen. And he says to me, he says, I know all these things you're doing. Right. Amen. And man, it sounds like he's just patting them on the back. Yeah. But then you get to well, verse 20, though. Look here in right. verse 20. Amen. It says, Notwithstanding, I have a few things against thee. Amen. Now, can I tell you, underline that in your Bible. Uh -huh. That's not a white thing. That's heavy thing. He said, I know you're doing this, I know you're doing that, I know you're doing this, I know you're doing that. But guess what? Notwithstanding, I got a few things against you. Amen. Amen. And your activity uh -huh. and your Christian action Come on. and your cloak Praise of what God. looks like Christendom, he said, I got some things against you. Because thou sufferest that woman Jezebel, Amen. which called herself a prophetess to Amen. teach and to seduce. My servants that commit fornication and eat things sacrificed unto idols. Amen. Hey, look at me. He's against preacher Jones and them. Amen. 
He's against women preaching. Amen. 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 Hey, get quiet. Amen. And I'll preach a little louder. Amen. Amen. He's against women preachers. He's Amen. against women preachers. He's against women Amen. preachers. He's against spiritual fornication. Amen. Amen. Seducing. They allow seducing to come in. They allow things to come in that God never ordained in the church. That, that God never blessed in the church. That God, the old brother Hargis, they're everybody's doing it. But we well, don't have to be everybody. Amen. That's right. Are you with me? Come on. We don't have to be everybody. Amen. We can just say, listen, real simple. I'm just going to go with the Bible. Amen. 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 Well, brother Hargis, why are you going to be Bible? Just go with the Bible. Amen. Let God be the truth and every man be a liar. Tell you what I, would be. I don't care what they're letting get into their house. I don't care Amen. what they're getting into their church. If they want the doctrines of the devils and the seducing spirits, I'm going with God. Amen. 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 This, I mean, this, this gets pretty serious, by the way. The fornicators, he's talking about anything a man does, he said, without a body except for fornication. Amen. We leave everything as fornications only in the acts of sexual. Uh, uh, acts, but it's right. not fornication is anything a man does openly, sinfully with his body, Amen. like eating food given to idols. Right. Amen. Y'all get real quiet. Come on, brother. Y'all get real quiet. Feel, feel like that Bible may be thumping somebody. Come on, Come on brother. What you do with the body when it's against the things of God that is fornication and spiritual life Amen. to everything you do that affects this, this temple. Because what temple are ye? If Amen. this is the temple of God, you're supposed to be holy, bless God. Amen. 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 We're in a day where nobody wants to talk about holiness. Nobody wants to talk Praise about God. holiness. Nobody wants to talk about it. But God, even in these latter days, still said, Be ye holy, for I am holy, saith the Lord. So you find that right there in First Peter chapter 1. I've got my book, verse 18, I believe it is. Yeah. Right? If I got my mind working right right now, I believe you can still find it even in these seducing Amen. days, in these days of a pop and hypocrisy. Man. Amen. Amen. We don't have to be like that. That's right. Amen. You know what I like about the internet? You go back to the internet, that's the thing I preach. Amen. 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 This is what I get. I'm Brother Hargis, he's this and he's that. Like, dude, show me the message I said there. Amen. Come on. Right. Amen. Preach it. Give, give me evidence. Amen. I mean, when we get up and preach, just stay in the Bible, we're safe. Somebody say amen. amen. And he had this against me. He said, no, look, let's keep reading. It don't get no better. Right. Amen. Look here in verse 21. And I give her space to repent of her fornication, and she repented not. Now stop right here, because I might have somebody say this right here. Now, Brother Hargis, that was pre-us. Come on. No. 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 Amen. Has the great tribulation happened yet? It has not yet. No. That's not that. Because before the tribulation happens, preacher, there's going to be a. Amen. 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 When that shell happens, the dead's going to rise first, sister, and I'm out of here, man. I'm catching heels. I'm heaven bound. Somebody yeah. says, I mean, I'm going out as the first man that's ever been over. Well, I won't give him a weight, but I'll be fine. Yeah. 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 I'm going to be about your size when you take glorified body. Amen. Yeah. Preach the way I do. I should be his size anyway. Yeah. Say amen. Amen. Yeah. Hey, man. I'm yeah. sure I should be living. If I get my glorified body, I don't know if we get to pick them out. We'll give me that buck 60. Amen. Amen. I want to feel like what it feels to be that little. Somebody say amen. 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 I ain't been a buck six yes, size in the eighth grade. Somebody hit me right there. <laughs> but I'm talking about it. it. Don't work out good. Look down there. You said, Brother Hargis, this ain't for us. Uh, so in verse 22. Amen. Behold, I will cast her in the bed, and then they commit adultery with her in a great tribulation. Amen. Except they repent of their deeds. Come on. Are y'all all right? Amen. I'm talking about the seducing spirits today. Amen. Allowing, and some of y'all letting it get in your house. Amen. Now, we listen at church, but we got in our car. Now, and you got your cigarette lighter up, about to light one up. Amen. Come on. Amen. Hey, thank you, brother. You might be the only one. Oh, but we ain't letting it. You let it in your house. Amen. 
You let it into your car. You let it into your job. It won't be long. It'll be getting you in the church house. Amen. They'll get up there preaching against Leonard Skinner. You won't like him no more. Amen. Come on. I sure love Brother Hargis when I first met him, but the longer I knew him, the meaner he got. Preach on, preacher. Why? I've been preaching the same way since the day I got called preach. Why am I getting mean now? Amen. 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 Ain't nothing more amazing than get preach after a while. Somebody be around you for a certain amount of time, and all of a sudden they're like, you know, I just never seen how mean you were. <laughs> <laughs> when was I mean? Amen. No, well, you just, you know, it's just, it's just your spirit. Well, if my spirit is lined up with the Word of God, Amen. That's right. and I preach out of love and compassion, Amen. I don't think it's my spirit they don't like. I think it's what I'm saying they don't Amen. like. Amen. Right. As everybody's cool until it gets on their top. So you take the dance until the dance gets you. Amen. Are y'all all right? You okay Come tonight? On. Is this preacher pretty good right now? Amen. Because I'm telling you, man, in these latter days, I'm tired of all this to let it creep into the church. We ain't letting it creep into ours. No. I, I'm not hanging out with any brethren that lets it creep into theirs. Amen. Amen. I see it identified. They ain't going to change it. I'm out. Amen. Can I tell you all these new Bibles is a part of the doctrines of devils? That's right. All, I know I'm where I'm at. We king. Let me take my hair and out. Make sure y'all are shouting. Amen. I said, we are King James. Amen. I said, we are King James. We authorize 1611 King James. And we, 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 for the word of God, we give me one Bible verse that tells me i got to be King James. What about that Psalm 119.89? Thy word is forever settled in heaven, O Lord. Amen. Why is it them other ones was the word of God? Why they got to put a copyright and rewrite them every day? Why they leave the Bible out? That's the word of God. Amen. You know, it's just simpler to understand. Oh, you're just in the latter day. Amen. I'm going to protect this Bible, let's go. Amen. I'd rather one of y'all hit the floor than that Bible. Amen. 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 Bro, you help me. Let's you set that over a Bible. You got that precious word in there. Somebody say amen. 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 I'd hold that Bible up for I let one of you. Y'all hit the ground for that Bible. Hit the ground. Amen. Say amen. amen. They're trying these doctrines of devil. They want the new versions out. Yeah. Because they want that say 37 deleted. They want the blood omitted. They want it all be taken out because then, then they can just tell you, since everything is missing, we'll just make it up as we go. That's 100% right, brother. This bunch of tongue talking. Come on. Tongue talking. Devil loving. Devil loving. Tongue talking. Y'all are all right. I feel like preaching. I'm not talking about the other. I'm not going after the way of man. I'm coming these latter days. We are not had that way. Amen. 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 I'm talking about they let to get in. They're letting to get in. If it was God's will, we'd let to get in. But I'm not changing my Bible. We gotta draw a crowd. I'm trying to draw Christ. Amen. I don't want the I don't want the power of man in here. That's right. I want the power of God in here. I don't want the fire of man. Hey, in these last days, brother, I want the fire of God in my life, baby. I don't want just a little bit either. You can have your little dab of it. Uh-huh, come on. Brother Steve Gooseby brought that up in his last He said, they used to tell you little, he said, I don't want a little dab. Amen. And I got happy on that. I said, thank God, Brother Steve, we're going to need more than a dab of it in these days. Everything they're trying to change on this Bible. Yeah. Every doctor Amen. trying to bring in a bunch of homosexuals. Preach it, right? Let me say that in a, in a, in a good night. Yeah. Amen. Ordaining them. Back in them. Somebody help me right Amen. here. I'm talking about, hey, he's a bunch of women preachers. Amen. He's a bunch, hey man, he's Amen. bunch of shacked up people. Amen. Shacked up strong. Amen. Help me right there. Hey, Brother James, he's shacked up strong, ain't he, brother? Amen. 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 I'm talking about, hey, 
day. And I know everybody else is doing it, Brother Hargis. Come on, preach it. Everybody else is accepting it. Everybody else smoking meth too. Where are you going to stop? Amen. 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 Why? Romans 16, 7, the Bible says, Now I beseech you, Brother Mark, them which cause division and offenses contrary to the doctrine which you've learned, and avoid them. Amen. Amen. He said, Mark Amen. them that's changing them doctrines. That's right. Amen. Them that's edited in them Bibles. Amen. Amen. You know what I think God lists? I'm going to tell you how good God is, how much God loves the country of the Philippines. Amen. 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 He, he's sending print presses over. Amen. Amen. Brother, don't y'all mess with the print presses when they get over. Amen. They'll be saturated in prayer. And then Bibles, when they handle them to y'all, turn the world upside down with them. Amen. Amen. I'm talking about turning the Philippines upside down. Amen. I'm talking about every Bible that's handed out over in the Philippines. Don't you let it get like America. Don't you let it get like this country. Amen. We've turned away from Amen. the world. Amen. That's a charge to you. Don't let your country get sick of the Bible. Let them get excited and stay excited about the Bible. Amen. Amen. That's right. Amen. 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 When you hand them out, hug them. Amen. Here's some treasure. Amen. I'm calling that love them, amen. amen. And mark them that wants to change them. Amen. Amen. Y'all going to get them. This is what's going to happen. Amen. You're going to get over it and the work's going to get hot. Yeah. Amen. And if somebody's going to come in and say, Yeah, we could do more if we did this. Yeah. And as soon as you hear that, <coughs> when it starts being you and I and we, bail. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Say, say stuff like, Amen. If God be for us. Amen. If God wants to do it. And if God will be the one doing it. And if God will move on it. Hey, unless He builds it, you labor in vain anyway. Amen. 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 And, but he says in these latter times what they'll give over to us. That's right. Seducing spirits and doctrines. The devil, may I tell you this, they'll speak lies and hypocrisy. Yep. Amen. They'll hold falsehoods as true. That's Amen. right. That's right. This is where we're at today. That's where we are at. I live in an area, this is what I hear all the time. But that ain't what Nanny said. Come on. Amen. All right. Well, your nanny was illiterate didn't even read the Bible. Amen. Amen. Never went to church. Why do you care what Nanny said? Amen. Yep. Amen. Well, it's getting quiet. Let's get real quiet right Come now. On, preach I'm talking about me in a day where everybody wants to tell God what they think instead of asking God what Amen. He thinks. Amen. Also, a lot of times, Brother Horace, we in them end days. I mean, it, let's just agree to get, just get along. Amen. That agreeing to get along has caused us a mess of each other. That's right. Amen. Let me just help y'all. So I'm a big, big Baptist. I'm an independent, fundamental. I believe that, she, that when Jesus came through the womb to Mary, it was through a virgin's womb. Amen. I believe that he was all God inside a man's body. Amen. I, I believe that he had no sin. Amen. I believe that Jonah was eaten by a well. Amen. I believe that Moses spoke to a burning bush. Amen. I believe by the hand of God that the water was parted and then Israelites walked through on dry land. I believe all that. Amen. Amen. And, oh, oh, Steve Goosby, I got some good stuff from that meeting. I'm going to share it with you. Steve Goosby said, man, come up to him and said, Steve, you're so crazy. Boy, you know that. Amen. He said, don't you know that that water was only ankle deep? Uh-huh. And Steve started to shout, said, wow. He said, what's wrong with you? He said, because if it was only ankle deep, he said, he drowned all of Pharaoh and his army in ankle deep water. Amen. He said, either way, it's awesome, man. Praise God for old time preachers and old time. Hey, stand in the way. Hey, man. And seek out them old paths. Where it is the good way. If I rest for your soul. Amen. I got so happy on that. I can tell y'all about that tonight. Amen. And I'm talking about in these latter days, they're wanting to change all this. They're wanting to, to cause a disruption. They're, they're wanting to get away from all that. Amen. And you know, the Bible says that, that they won't be given to marriage and they'll sustain from eating. And you know why they're wanting to do all this? Take your Bibles back over to the text, first ten. Amen. Amen. By the way, they are from Bud and Mary, and they are trying to abstain from me. I was tired of this bunch of Jewish Amen. diet. Amen. I am. 
Don't get mad at me because I'm about to give you enough Bible. You can Amen. Tell you but I'll tell you this if I could put barbecue on a pig squill, I'd eat it. Amen. Amen. Come on. Amen. Amen. Come on. Amen. I like bacon. Amen. Amen. I like sausage. Come on. Oh, yeah. I'm feeling spiritual right here. Come on. <laughs> they, they came up to me. I don't know why they came up to me, brother. You know, I don't know why. But this is what they did. Brother Jeff's son, Jeffrey, and, and his son in law came up to me and said, Brother Hargis, you know what's back there on that big smoker? Oh, squirrel. <laughs> Ho hog. Amen. And at first I got offended, like, why did you come to me out of everybody's in this camp? Amen. Here? Then I thought, you know what? It's because they probably realized Brother Hargis likes whole hog. Amen. Amen. Y'all all right? And in the day that we're living in, we have everybody trying to live forever. You know that's why they, they're doing the things they're going to try to live forever. And brother, I'm all about not being a gluttonous man. Amen. I should be 150 pounds, but I'm not. I'm saying, man, I tell you. Amen. But, but I, I'm against gluttony. I'm against sin in any form and fashion. Amen. But what they're really trying to do is they're trying to do these things because they're trying to get you to, help, to think you're going to live forever. Yep. But God, I tell you, it's the point that a man wants to die. That's right. Amen. If you're if you're real skinny and you take vitamins, good for you. Right. Amen. I'm, I'm not being mean. I'm being serious. Amen. If your blood pressure is 118 over 62, and you don't feel like you're having a heart attack every time you're drinking you who I'm really great. Amen. Amen. Are y'all are y'all getting hurt? Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm, I look. I mean, I'm a big dude. I talk about big people. It's Amen. Cool. Amen. Come on. If I was 150 pounds, I wouldn't say a blessed part thing about big people. Preach on. Amen. 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 But, you know, I'm going to tell you something. As long as you're not in sin, Amen. be happy with how God created you. Amen. 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 I went to the doctor the other day, and he said, man, you got the heart of an 18 year Amen. Blood pressure. Now, don't get me wrong. I don't want to stay. Amen. Them knees giving out one day. Somebody help me right there. He said, blood pressure, well, I can't know what was it, 62 or 64. He said, he walked in a little skinny, and he goes, I hate you. <laughs> he said, I got high cholesterol. Amen. I was young. And then you, I'm like, man, back up. <laughs> <laughs> because what we, we're doing, we're making this about us, about what feeds the flesh, like the brother said. We're wanting everything to be on the fleshly understanding. But that's not where God wants our treasure to be, nor they do want our heart to be. That's right. But see, that's why they're distracting us with all this. Yep. Amen. When I heard about monkey pox, I know y'all tired. It's I don't know what time it is. It don't matter. I should just let you preach for three hours. I was loving it. I should just said preach on, let you preach three hours. I'll stay here all night. Amen. Amen. When I heard about that monkey pox, the first thing I said, Oh, here we go again. Amen. 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 Here we go again. Lockdowns and shots, and, and then they come back and say, COVID's back. Yep. I said, You know what? Stomach flu's back, flu's back. <laughs> if they, you know what? They, the can, cure, they can cure AIDS, but they can't cure allergies. Come on. Amen. I said, They ain't got as much money as Matthew Johnson's. Amen. Amen. That's right. Come on. You know what? All that craziness. Did you hear about any kings, queens, emperors, or presidents dying from that? Amen. Preach on, Did you hear about that? Amen. We got a senile old man. Don't even know where he's at. He seemed to live through. Amen. Did you hear that? Then not one time. Did you hear? Let me ask you a question. Y'all look at me. I'm trying to help you tonight. I know we're in the last days, but we ought to live like we're in the last days. Amen. When COVID was going around, how many governors you hear about dying? Amen. Come on. They was going to everywhere. No governors. No, no princes. No kings. Amen. No, no dignitary of any high order. I'm Amen. talking about no, no, none of these, none of these. I mean, Nancy Pelosi's 140 if she's a day. <laughs> she got it and, and then showing off how, her thousand dollar ice cream collection. Amen. You got to be dumb to have an ice cream collection. I'm just gonna tell you right now. Amen. You got an ice cream collection. You're in sin. Say Amen. 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 Sell that ice cream, buy you a gun collection. Somebody Amen. Amen. Right there. But, but, but in these last days, Come on. all this is being flooded towards. Yep. Changing the Bibles and yep. changing the churches and changing the Christian. It's because of verse 5 of 1 Timothy 4. Look down there real quick. This is what he says. For it is sanctified by the word of God in prayer. 
If thou put the brethren in remembrance of these things, thou shalt be a good minister of Jesus Christ, nourished up in the words of faith and of good doctrine, wonder thou hast a time. Amen. See, see, you know why you can eat meat? Because as long as you're thankful, because way back there in Acts, yeah. mm -hmm. when Peter saw that that blanket come Amen. down, God said, don't you ever call what I've cleansed come. Yeah. That's right. Amen. Amen. He said, if a man looks on a woman, back here in Matthew, mm -hmm. that would they commit adultery in the heart. Amen. Amen. See, all these things are trying to bring against us and these seducing spirits and these lies and yes. hypocrisies and, and all this other stuff. Amen. It's for one reason. They want the Bible believers to give up what they believe. Amen. 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 That's it. That's right. Amen. I said all that to literally say this. They want your kids. Amen. They want your families. Amen. And more importantly, they want your church. Amen. 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 I've never seen the day. I was enlightened the other day. Two crackheads got on the internet and decided to attack me both of them. Amen. I, and I'm serious. One one seeped out the other one, the other one said, Yeah, he's you know, and and, and, and all that. The mother of one came to me and said, They don't like you. You know, I'm a balance sheet. Some of you say, oh, I'm really hard to see who cares. I do. Somewhere along the line, they was tricked in all this. Amen. Amen. Yep. Because you know what that mother told me today? And y'all don't know who he is. Who he tried to guess. You don't even know. You don't. But I want you to listen to me. She said, it's not personal, but ours. They just hate that you preach the Bible. Amen. Amen. Come on. And you know what the worst part about this is? Mm -hmm. I'm not against them, friend. Amen. Amen. Don't y'all start moving around and, and, and go, listen, real good. I'm not done yet. I'll say amen and we'll pray when I'm done. Amen. amen. But it broke my heart. Amen. Because you know the devil has convinced them I'm against them and I'm not. Amen. amen. Come on. It's just these lighter days, there's going to be some of this to depart from the thing. That's right. Amen. But if everybody else leaves, but just and I'm not. Amen. Amen. Other people's gonna listen to outside sources like Amen. Google. Mm -hmm. like Google. Come on. Amen. If you get your doctrine on Facebook, by the way, you are not right in that. Amen. Amen. You don't need Facebook. That's right. I'm gonna tell you right now. Now y'all might get a little kinked up on this. I'm against electronic Bibles. Amen. Because they can change electronic yep. Bibles. Amen. In fact, I proved this to my wife not too long ago. When I pulled up an electronic Bible and I showed her in a King James electronic Bible, did they not change the word? Yeah, they did. Amen. But in these last days, friend, we've got something to stick with. Amen. Amen. We've got something to stand by. This is trustworthy. Don't 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 put it in, Brother Harvest. But I hope I I hope I end right. But if I go stupid somewhere along the way, they, they're going to have to find there's more than me that got to find Amen. 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 That's right. Amen. Amen. I wish I could tell you every man that's ever got a Bible pulpit made it to the end, but that's not true for you. No. Amen. But I will tell you something that's endured the entire age of time and according to its own words, never loses a jot nor tittle. That's right. Amen. Come on. Amen. It's sealed. Yep. It's preserved. And in these latter days, if we're not going to fall to that crowd, we better stay by the book. Y'all stay with me all that. Y'all heard enough preaching. If you're lost in here, that brother gave enough blood gospel. Yes, that's Amen. Right. Amen. Amen. I feel that's like good. It, I feel like it was a beautiful compliment. Amen. He said, I'm happy to be saved. And I thought I'd be saved. Me too. Amen. <laughs> Thank God I'm saved. Yeah. You know, in, in all this world, people dying, you know, because they've always been doing that and we act like it's a new thing. Amen. Amen. Right. Come on. You know, Mom, I thank God I know where I'm going with you. Real car was preaching that blood. This is covering me, man. It's got me. It never runs out. Whenever I, I'm still studying out the tabernacle, I'm going to be teaching on it here soon. Yeah. You look inside that, that ark, there's a Bud of Aaron, Aaron's rod. That's right. Amen. It's the picture of eternal life. Yes, it is. 
I thank God that the same life that God gave into that bud is what He gave me when I got saved. That's right. Amen. It never goes out. That's right. But I'm going to ask you this tonight. What about you? Hey, what about you? Amen. If you was to draw your last breath tonight, Amen. do you know where you're going? Amen. And I'm not talking about hell. If you know you're going to hell, then run up here real quick and get saved. Amen. Amen. But if you aren't saved, if you are not saved, then you have not the Spirit of God and you're none of His. Amen. Amen. But I wonder if there's one in here tonight. Is there anybody in here saying, Brother Harkis, I'd like to get saved. I'd like to get born and get from above. Is there anybody that might get saved? Is there anybody in here that's lost? Anybody lost? Let me ask you this. How many, how many would be honest and say, Brother Harkis, I know 100% for sure I'm going to heaven. How many Amen. Amen. Oh, yeah. the Lord. And if you Amen. all know you're going to heaven, let me ask this question here. Then. Have me be honest and say, Brother Horace, I do not want to be that crowd of latter days. Amen. 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 You better listen to this preacher. You better take heed where you stand. Amen. Amen. And you better live your right. life. Surrender to the Lord. Amen. All over the house, he's off to his Amen. Amen. Thank you.